the Kennedys, a rich, famous and powerful family. Few other names in history have been associated with hope, glamour and severe blows of fate as much as the Kennedys. John F. Kennedy moves into the White House in January 1961 and for the first time politics becomes young, vibrant and sexy. The dream of a better America ends with his assassination in Dallas on November 22, 1963. John F. Kennedy's untimely death plays a major role in the myth surrounding his name. His presidency, with Jackie Kennedy by his side, will later be compared with Camelot, the mythical castle of King Arthur. I'm very proud of my uncle and my father. They gave us a tremendous gift, which was the legacy of, of their work and a very clear and coherent philosophy about what America is supposed to look like, a vision of, of what America is supposed to look like. In the USA, his words appeal to people across all social classes. His signal for a new beginning is received with enthusiasm by the younger generation all around the globe. He was a figure of promise. He was young. America was in need of something new. He dared to say we could go to the moon. What a wild thought. What most people don't know is that JFK's health has been frail for most of his life. If the public knew how many medical problems he had, I think it would have uh, destroyed his presidential ambitions because they would have said, no, it's, it's, uh, it's not to be trusted. You know, a president has his finger on the nuclear trigger. The Kennedys live the life of the American upper class. They owe their wealth to JFK's father, Joseph P. Kennedy.